This is Sean. We're on a job today in Greensboro and we've got a drainage ditch across here and what's happening is the water is coming way down this hill hitting here the pipes all clogged up the culverts too small and the concrete people who poured the second apron here just kind of threw a small pipe in here and it's it, what it does is it just completely overflows and then it's digging all that out eroding that away check out this video that the homeowner sent me this is from about a year ago but you can see how that ditch is just completely overflowing and it's just skipping right over that driveway and so by mucking out the ditch a little bit and hopefully slowing down the water with our riprap we'll get that water to slow down and then head into a pipe instead of just skipping over the driveway like that and the problem she was having was right here it was just eroding away along the driveway and this is all new concrete so she really wanted to get this taken care of So we've got some riprap in here. We've got the big dump truck, so we should be able to put, muck this out a little bit and put it, put it in the front of the truck and get it all in one trip. So we're trying to beat the rain today. A little bit more. That should be good. That should be good. Yep. And maybe I'll get you up here throwing a few of them around.
Do we need any more on the other side? You want to put some of these little ones in the... In the hole right there? Yeah. To help slow it down? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I just reworked these rocks a little bit. So the idea here is this water's coming down. You can see how fast it's going and how much it's gouging out right there. But we want to slow it down with this riprap. It should, we want to keep it in the ditch and then we want to get it to go through that little tiny culvert there. So that culvert really needs to be probably a 15 or an 18 inch. I think it's a 12 inch. And the homeowner Rightly so she just had this concrete done and she just doesn't want to pay To have this concrete torn up and have a new culvert put in there So that's what's going on Almost there aren't we? Slow that water down too. The customer was out here looking at this and she asked me if I would try to rework this a little bit. So it's not perfect, but she wanted to get that irrigation line covered back up. And again, she's not really trying to do a lot of work out here, at least not right now. The state really should be doing this, but she's had a lot of problems dealing with them. So we're just trying to get it a little bit better than what it is right now. We are finished with this job. so. Corey just reworked where this irrigation line was in here and the homeowner just came out and looked at it and she's real happy with that. And so we've got our outfall right here. And we've got our inlet right here. We tried to keep the inlet real open with some flat rocks that will hopefully let the water go right in there. And then all this riprap up here is meant to slow the water down. So the water slows down and then it makes its way into the pipe as opposed to washing over here real quickly and overwhelming and going over the driveway like it used to do. So we're just trying to clean up a little bit before the rain really starts. So it's the next morning here and I wanted to come out here and take a look at what's going on with this drainage pipe that we mucked out yesterday. And so take a look at what's happening here. This is exactly what I was hoping would happen is we're slowing the water down right here. You see how fast it's moving up there. We're slowing it down here. It's not coming out into the street and it's now getting re-channeled and it's going right into the pipe. And so that's exactly how I was envisioning and hoping this would work. The whole idea here was the water was coming down way too fast across here and then skipping over the driveway. 
So it looks like this is going to work pretty well to solve this flooding issue. Boy, that's a lot of water coming through there, isn't it? I know, right? So if you've never seen it around the corner, uh huh. Like it's it's like a it's like insane the force is coming down around the corner. Mm. Three, three, let's go. Ten. See this um, pipe is I think a little clogged up. Yeah, at least it's flowing through here well. Yeah. So that's good. If we can get it a nice a nice channel and flow to here. It'll take it, it yeah, looks like. Yeah, because look at how, like, much of it's pulled right here at the foot of my driveway. Yeah. So. Oh, yeah. This is some relatively new in the last few months. Amy, come here. Oh, I won't wrap around the mailbox. <laughs> so you think this might be the next little project? Yeah. 